Akal, and now at a time when there is a growing apprehension in the state of following the detection of first COVID-19 case in the state. A couple of days ago, it has uh, come to light that personal protection equipment and N95 mask available at the Naga Hospital in Kohima may not be up to the mark. In fact, the hospital authorities themselves indirectly raised questions on the quality of PPEs and masks provided to the hospital even as they initiated steps to also come up with their own safety kits. Speaking to Northeast Life, PRO of Naga Hospital Authority said, while over 300 PPEs were made available to the hospital, they were of different qualities and the consignment seems to have some issues. The hospital authorities added that they are not relying 100% on the quality of the consignments received and have come up with own ways to equip themselves with proper kits. It has been learned that while some of the PPEs provided to the hospital had a manufacture date of as back as 2007, some of the N95 masks had fungus in them. In fact, the police department has donated the hospital with 3,000 Makintosh waterproof materials, out of which the hospital is stitching its PPEs. Whatever consignments that we have received, uh, we have received it from the government of India. And so uh, this, this question can be asked to them. But as far as we are concerned, <coughs> uh, the effectiveness of the, because all the, all the things that have been sent, they have that ISM mark. So we, we hope and pray that that should be genuine. But uh, if it is not, then I think only time will tell. But to my understanding, uh, the effectiveness and the, the quality of a, a PPA can only be done when the patient starts coming in. So only then we come to know the, uh, the effectiveness of the PPE that has been given to us. But I think uh, <coughs> keeping in mind the seriousness of the illness, the Naga Hospital um, Authority and the core team uh, of the hospital has taken it, taken it into uh, consideration that we should not be satisfied with what has been given by the government of India, but we have to try to make our own indigenous kind of uh, preparedness. And the police department, they had been very kind to us. They had given us uh, <clears throat> 3,000 sets of, uh, we call it Macintosh, the one that we use for the as raincoats, that has been given to us free of cost. And with that, uh, we are making those typical jumpsuits because that is waterproof. So uh, 3,000 is a huge number. Uh, they had brought it in almost uh, two trucks. And uh, now those, those jumpsuits are being uh, tailored by the police department. So the police department has come forward and are providing uh, all those uh, you know, the jumpsuits and the tailoring that has been, the material as well as the tailoring of the jumpsuits. So that is one part that the police have come into the, come forward with. And meanwhile, the Naga Hospital has made all possible arrangements in the wake of COVID-19 crisis. The authorities informed that the hospital has 67 beds in place along with nine ventilators. All in-house patients have been shifted to private hospitals as the institute has been turned into a full-fledged COVID treatment. Update till 2 p.m. of yesterday, that is the 13th of April, is total cases seen at the COVID hospital at Naga Hospital is 187, out of which we have sent about 53 samples. 30, have, 30 results have come negative. The results of the 23 that we sent yesterday is expected uh, very soon, this evening. So, uh, Naga Hospital has been converted into a COVID hospital as per the government orders. And at present, we are ready with about 67 beds ready to take up the COVID positive cases.